Hello everyone, hope you guys had an excellent turkey time, and also hope you guys survived Black Friday. Yeah, it was pretty crazy that day, pretty crazy. But um, luck for me, man, I didn't go super late that Black Friday, because you know, I have seen a video where a woman literally tried to steal something from a little kid, and then the mom tried to take it back, and the woman acted like she don't know why the woman's doing it in the first place. Black Friday's crazy day, it's always good to bring some pepper spray or a switchblade <laughs> or some, even a stun gun for God's sake, because Black Friday's crazy. But however, um, I don't go that late. It's ridiculous to go that late. But for some reason, at the end, the stuff I always want is always there. You know, so I go there and I always give myself a good, valuable deal. Like, if you can already spot out the deals and know how long they're gonna last and where they're gonna be at, you're pretty much good. You pretty much go at any time you want to. In fact, I actually um, went to the mall and GameStop, and that's it for Black Friday. I don't really go anywhere else. Just mall and GameStop. Do you need to go to Walmart or or um, Hobby Lobby or anything like that? Just those two stores, and I really did enjoy myself that Black Friday. In fact, I didn't start my Black Friday shopping until freaking like what it was like it was one o'clock. The time I started was it was 1 p.m. So, anyways, enough of that. Let me show you what I got for this Black Friday because this to me was actually the best Black Friday for me. So, anyways, let me show you. First store I went to was Hot Topic, and um, what they had was a deal on there where you could buy all shirts were ten dollars, and if you buy ten shirts, you get yourself a little fifteen dollar gift card. Um, three shirts, three shirts, not ten shirts. It's all shirts were ten dollars. Anyways, got this. This Walking Dead, Daryl from Walking Dead, awesome, only $10. The other two shirts was for my brother and my best friend, so they got them. So in the meantime, as for my gift, we're buying those three shirts. I got myself a $15 gift card, so pretty much $15 off of any purchase that's above $30 in the store. But this don't start until, like, what, January 14th or something like that. Like, I gotta wait that long. Not sure, whatever. Anyways, it's still good, I guess, if I want me a cool jacket or something, $15 off. So I got myself a nice shirt, and also got myself a gift card. What else I did get was also, bam, these. Everyone's into beats. For me, I've always been a Skull Candy guy. I love Skull Candies. And these are the wireless Skull Candies, man. These things even talk. Like, we turn them on, it's not like a computer is activating like Droop. and then we pair it so the voice is now pairing and then we turn it off it sounds like a system computer shutting off they're really cool they're really loud and bass even without even having up at least halfway is extremely loud itself and plus adding on with its own volume together with the computer or phone volume will make it even louder than it already was so these things go loud and they go hard they're sweet. I love Skull Candies. Beats overrated. Now for my main brand, beautiful price. This is one I didn't expect to actually get this year. But I did because, you know, I I pulled off a deal, man. I pulled off one hell of a deal. And it is a PlayStation 4, baby. <laughs> yeah, look at that shit, man. Look at that. PlayStation 4. Hello. So anyway, um, the story was is that I didn't really get that on Black Friday, to tell you the truth. I got that actually before Black Friday. So um, Friday before. I was in there to trade games to repair for that Black Friday. Then he says, more likely you're not going to get that console because if you're not planning to come in early, you're going to lose it. So he says, here's what I can do for you. He said, if I sold in my PS3, which I wasn't really using anymore, Together with my um, so my Vita games, he's the way he knew a hundred dollars off pretty much already, and including um, the twenty dollars already off, the hundred twenty dollars off of my thing. So, all the people who paid pretty much two ninety nine for that Uncharted bundle edition pretty much got for two ninety nine. Me, I used my I used my store credit and I got that baby down to like two fifty something, baby. Too fucking busy. I am good. I am good. Now, s coming with the PlayStation, of course, I said it was a bundle, and the bundle came with the Uncharted Edition, the Collector's Edition. Pretty much, it had all the Uncharted, three Uncharted games from the PS3, and of course, a beta testing 
for the Uncharted 4 game that's coming out soon, like next year and stuff. So yeah, I'm, I'm going to get that. You know, I never played the Uncharted series before, even when I did have PS3, I still never played it. Right? Weird. Next, um... Now, another good deal I get, because I'm always about good deals, like, I can't get something off. I did something amazing. Since I didn't have a PS3 no more, I sold all my PS3 games. And I got, it was only like 8 PS3 games, and I got $59 in store credit, okay? So, when people say, you don't get much when you're selling your games, I never really understood that, because I always got myself good credit every time I sold my games in. And I only sold an 8, and I got $59 back. What does that say? So anyways, um, with that, only need to pay $4 for Fallout 4. Only $4. That's it. That's it. Only four freaking dollars. So it's, that's, you can't beat that. Because, like, last time I got Call of Duty on Black Ops 3, I only had to pay $15. Because I'm really good deals. But now I was able to pay only $4 for Fallout 4, man. <laughs> I'm good. And finally, to wrap things up. I, they're having a buy two pre-owned games and get one free. So this one I didn't have to pay full price. Well, there were used games. And, well, here they are. We got Infamous Second Son. I'm a big fan of the Infamous series. It's really good. In, even the comics and the other side stories. They're really good. Yeah, so I like it. And the second game I got was the Metroid Redux. Both games of Metroid into one game disc. So yeah, I'm starting off good. As for the third game, I got some from my brother. He went Sly 4 Thieves in Time for the PS3. Even though I already had it, and I told him to play it then, he was like, oh, I don't want to play it. And now he wants to play it. So he got that game back. He's happy, and I'm happy. And I got, I got, it was a good Black Friday. It was good. No chaos. It's about one part where I was in FYE. That's where I got the Skull Candies at, at FYE. And we were just waiting in line. And we got here. This woman saying, excuse me. And she's speaking so low. And she only said once. So she's like, I said it. She said, excuse me. Like, well, we didn't hear you. So everyone looking at her. You know, her like, hey, dude. If they ain't hear you, she'll speak up louder. Exactly. So <laughs> anyway, after that, it was great. After that, we went to Cold Stones and Barnes & Noble, talked to some few manga fans, and it was a good Black Friday. This was the best Black Friday, and this also was one of the best Thanksgivings I ever had in a really long time. It was really good. Maybe because there were that many people there, and just right now, and everyone bought a shit ton of food. So, yeah. I love this Black Friday, and I love the Thanksgiving. Hopefully Christmas, New Year's, and, of course, Ichiban is going to be amazing, just as amazing, I really hope so, because so far, holidays kicking off really good, so anyway, thank you for watching this video, if you like this video, please like, rate, comment, subscribe, share if you could, I'll be much obliged, this is background, man, man. sign out.